That's been oh, oh, nice. Oh, he's rocked. Rocked. And that rocked Lee. And then the flying knee Richard. sends him down. A split decision loss to Luke Whelan. How does he get back on the winning track here, Joe? Well, he said in that fight he was a little bit overtrained. They didn't feel great. So I'm sure a lot of his adjustments happened, you know, before this fight. But Gershon really known for his explosive kicking. But Lee has that speed that he wants to use to his advantage. He does look fast. Break! Zhao Yong Lee. Break! A Chinese Wushu Sanda champion. Gold medalist at 70 kilograms. What's the difference between Sanda and kickboxing, Joe? Well, they have a little bit of clinch throwing. Um, so it's, it's a little bit different, especially when it comes to the aspects of the clinch. But very similar, and it's still a lot of experience to bring in here. Nice body kick, but there are the hands of Zhao Yong Li. And I was watching Gershon hitting pads the other day. It looks like he's going to switch stances quite a bit in this fight. Now he's at orthodox, and he switches to that southpaw quite often. Seems like this fight's going to be about the punches of Lee and the kicks of Gershon. No holding. Fight! Gershon was supposed to fight Josh Johnson in Miami, but cracked a rib in training on his left side. Couldn't make that fight. Here he is here. Says he's 100% healthy now. Great. Lee's coming with some solid aggression in yeah. those hands. I like it. But Gershon now using the punch to set up the low oh, kick. Spinning heel kick, it connected as well. But Zhao Young Lee walked through it. Great. No holding. Zhao Young fight. Lee's here to fight. After that landed, Gershon thought maybe he could take a step back and collect himself, but Zhao Young Lee was right up in his grill. I like that right low kick from Gershon. Spinning attack again. But Lee doesn't give him a chance to breathe. Counters right back. Right. Up. Time. There's no sweeps. Do you understand? No sweeps. Hey. You good? Timing. Fight. Nichols reminding Gershon no sweep. You can kick the leg out, but you can't sweep it out. Break. Big difference. Fight! Nice kicks from E. Tiger Sean here in round one. Yeah, from his southpaw, he likes that body kick from the orthodox stance, attacking the lead leg. Break! see Gershon with that spinning heel kick. We've seen him throw it in his prior glory fights. And he sets it up well with his low kicks. But Lee's hand was just there. That's why it's a game of inches. And that landed pretty flush. If the heel landed on the temple, it would have been over. And Itai Gershon, I mean, we saw that spinning back kick. But the key for him in this camp, they said, was the difference was going to Kuzma's gym, where he got to train with, you know, the likes of Alexei Ulyanov, Artem Bakitov, and all the guys there in Kuzma's Russia. Zhao Yang Li from Wuhan, China. I mentioned he's a former Sanda champion, and it's obvious to us so far, he is all about the hands. Loves throwing punches. Fight! We will soon see the judges' official scores from round one. Four of the five giving it to the Israeli. Yep, they're valuing those power kicks. A lot of those punches from Lee are, are being thrown, and it looks like they're doing damage, but they're not scoring as much of those power kicks. You'd rather get hit than kicked any day, wouldn't you? Uh, punched? Yeah, in the face. And that's where you got to block that. That's what Gershon's doing, blocking the punches, chopping away. Yep. Solid defense from Itai Gershon. Break! Break. 
23 Fight. kicks landing for Gershon, just one for Zhao Yang Li. I really like that stance switching and level changing with the kicks from Gershon. How does Gershon stack up with the rest of this division, Joe? Well, I think he's he's slowly getting better and used to the higher levels. And I mean, he says back home he doesn't really have sparring partners. That's why he's going to Kuzbas to gain that experience. And he's one of these fighters that levels up every time he comes. So I think it's a process where, I mean, Josh Johnson, a guy that's really up there, so they're calling for the bigger names. Sean trained with Alexei Ulyanov and Kuzbas, who we'll see later tonight. A win for him, and he gets a shot at the featherweight world title. Break! Break! That right low kick from Itai is going to add up. Break! You can already see the redness on Lee's lead leg. Again, trying that heel kick. Doesn't quite connect. Fight. And that heel kick set up really well with that right low kick. Nice jab for Gershon. Oh, nice right hand. Connected perfectly for Gershon, who's done most of his damage with kicks. Yeah, he's not overly concerned with the power that Lee has in his hands. So that's why he's able to, to load up on the big shots. Trash talking. I'm not sure that they understand. Uh, Eton other. speaks Chinese, <laughs> Itai rather, but either way, I like that stare down. Snapchat. If you don't have it, download it. And once you get Snapchat, download us. Subscribe to Glory's channel with new weekly episodes featuring bone crushing knockouts, event recaps, along with the best highlights in combat sports. Finding it is easy. Just type in glorykickboxing.com and hit subscribe. Fight! Schedule for three rounds, and this is the third. For the five judges, again, scoring it for Gershon. So Lee needs a knockdown. And the corner of Gershon is asking for the low kicks. And I agree. It's been landing the best. It's doing the most damage. He needs to keep them up. Gershon got into fighting because of necessity. Saying that when he was 14 years old, a group of older teenagers beat him up, and one of them cut him with a knife. Break! So he said he headed straight to the gym to learn how to defend himself. Look at the low kicks, or the leg kicks, rather. Yeah, he's, he's just pounding away. I like when he sets them up with his punches. That's been my oh, favorite. Right. Oh, he's oh. And that rocked Lee. And then the flying knee Neutral. sends him down. Neutral. Neutral. One, and that will be a knockdown. Two, three. Spectacular four, stuff. Five. That was like a six. Air. Seven. Air Gershon. Eight. Gloves up. Yep, gloves up. Well, I don't know if Lee's right. going to be in any condition to oh. continue. There's oh. another flying knee in Gershon unloading now. Break. Break. He's going right after Fight. Lee. There's some space. Let's see if he does it again. Nope. Calms down now. Break. Break. Sometimes it's it's better Break. to stay patient for a second. Let Lee get comfortable again and then set up the big power shot. So that trash talking got Gershon fired up. Break. 
Break. A lot of that spectacular offense, the spin kick, the flying knee, that's from hard low kicks. Rashawn looking for his second knockout victory here in glory. Ooh, oh. that one hooked to the back of the head. Oh. Minute to go here. Lightweight division. There's a spinning heel kick for Lee. Let go. Let go. Fight. Doubling the strikes landed is for Sean while throwing fewer strikes overall. Yeah, precision striking. Break. Let go. Lee's Final showing warning. that Chinese fight. fighting spirit. They always come to fight and leave it all in there. Oh, double back fist for Gershon. Oh, that's a trip. No, no, no. <laughs> Fight. Paul Nichols with his comedy routine scoring some points. And the audience enjoying it. Tiger Sean with the best round of his glory career gets a knockdown and a win in the process. But how about Zhao Young Lee showing us some tough? Yeah, absolutely, he's on the, the the ropes now, waving to the crowd. But Gershon, that spinning heel kick, just perfectly timed, set up well, and he just came flying with that knee. That's where Nichols called it. But Gershon setting it up with his right kick, spinning around. And there's so much power you can generate from those spin attacks. But if that knee was, you know, two, three inches to the left, I think Lee would have had a different shaped nose. But good pressure, good power from Gershon. Really looked for the finish. I think we all appreciated that. So a good performance for Israel's Itai Gershon, the official decision when we return. Let's look at highlights from Itai Gershon and Zhao Yong Lee. Yeah, Zhao Yong Lee came out aggressive with his boxing, but Gershon really started using his kicks. We saw him really focus on those low kicks, trying to get his power punches going. And just very precise, picking his shots. Then he landed that spinning heel kick, came in with the flying knee, got the knockdown. You know, Gershon wanted a finish. He wanted a spectacular fight. And Lee was the perfect opponent to show that. He kept coming forward. Fantastic fight. Gershon landing almost double Lee's output. 102 of 177 compared to 52 of 186. Gershon with the kicks. Lee with the hands. Tim Hughes now with the decision. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of kickboxing, we go to the judges' scorecard. Here now are the totals. One of our judges scores it even, 28-28. But our four remaining judges all see them out and score them out the same. 30-26 for your winner by majority decision. Itai Gershaw! I'm here with your winner, Itai Gershon. You know, now four and one in glory. Give me your thoughts on fighting here and your overall performance. Uh, well, I, I think I can better, you know. I didn't watch the fight, but uh, from how I was uh, feeling myself, I can much better, I know that. I think I'm, I have to be more busy in the ring and my performance will be much better. And you're all gonna, you all are gonna enjoy my performance. All right, let's take a look at the screens and let's go through that third round. He came out aggressive with his boxing and you used your kicks. Give me your thoughts on this third round. Sorry, what? Give me your thoughts on this third round. You scored a nice knockdown, that spinning heel kick. Uh, I saw he's like, he was a little bit dizzy after the, the round that was kick. I go with a jumping knee, you know, just want to explosive to finish him, but he was, he was tough, you know. Some people are very tough, you can't finish whenever you want. So, um, I feel, you know, thankful for this, uh, for this moment, for this fight, for, thanks to my opponent.
Were you surprised that he stayed up after landing that kick in those knees? Uh, no, because uh, he's a tough guy, you know, not... People who are fighting here, not so... They're not, not made from sugar, you know? <laughs> they're tough guys, you know? All right, Arna, let's hear it for your winner, Itai Gershon. I want to, to thank my, you know, my coach, my guys there in Chai Peminga, you know? I, I can't do nothing without them here in the ring, you know? Thank you very much, guys. We look forward to seeing you again. Itai Gershon.